welcome everybody to KPE Paranormal. Today we are here at Earl's Cemetery. This cemetery is on the side of the road and it's basically a family cemetery. We are going to show you all what the cemetery looks like and then we're going to do an investigation to see what kind of evidence we could capture here at Earl's Cemetery. It is getting ready to get dark so right now it's during the day. Let's continue. Make sure to smash the like button. Let's get started. There's a grave behind the tree. Right here, grave behind the tree. Now, I apologize if you all might hear any road noises. Just bear with me and enjoy the investigation. Let's see what evidence we can capture here at the cemetery. Let's do this. All right, we're gonna get the equipment. Service out here is not the greatest, so might not be able to do a live due to connection. See where I'm feeling the energy to start. Let's see, so I'm gonna focus my energy and to see the spiritual energy of the area where I feel would be most active. I have Joey with me here today. So Energy's not back over there. I just heard a voice beyond there. So I already heard a voice. Um, Saddle like a name. Have to go back and replay the footage. So, okay, like right about here, that's where I'm feeling the energy. It's over there, right over there. I'm not feeling no energy, but right here, like in this spot, 
right here. So to where y'all can see me. I'm like a silhouette in the sun and the shadow of the tree blaring on me. So you, I don't think you all can see me that well. Um, hopefully you all can. But let me go into the light and there we go. But right back behind me right there. That's where the energy I'm picking up where we might get the most activity at. So we're going to start right there because over there, there's like not that much energy. And that's where I mainly heard the voices are in this area, right? So that's where we're going to start. Let's get the equipment out and see what we can capture here. All right. So first things first, since we know our spot, we got to get the tripod right here I think they moved okay here we go right here they're over here so going to put this on bear with me be right back awesome okay So, I'm gonna get the calf balls out. That's why I have the camera pointing right there just in case if one of the calf balls go out. By the spirit. Cat ball. Thank you. Can you do that again, please? Touch the same cat ball again. Can you touch this one again, please? The one right next to I'm holding it. Can you light up to purple, please? Cap on. Thank you. I will. Cap on. Can you touch that again, please? Thank you. So I got the cat balls to go off on response. Now let's see if we can have the spirit make it go to purple. Can you light up to purple please? So we got the spirit talker on to see what kind of response that we could get. Um, the activity, that's probably me. Um, now the activity that we got so far. To avoid this area. Avoid this area. And this is the area I was mentioning about the energy of the activity that we are getting will be active. Because we got the cat ball to go off. Red pods going off. And we're trying to see if we could get it to purple. Um, and the first response we got was avoid this area. Why do we need to avoid this area? I shouldn't be dead. But why should we avoid this area? He light up to purple. Use the energy to light up to purple, please. Oh no. Why not? 
I legit her no. I said use your energy to light up the purple. And I heard no. Just like that. Alright, so when I said can you use your energy to light up the purple? I heard a spirit said said exactly like this. He or she said no. Just like that. It was clear. So they do not want to use the energy. Alright. I know you're right beside me. Plan shed. Plan chat and I got the Ouija board. No, we ain't doing no Ouija board. It's a plan chat, y'all. It said plan chat, and I got a Ouija board in my backpack with a plan chat. Maybe a whistle happened like right in the area, the circle. Before the cemetery was developed, possibly. Now it's kind of possibly hard to see the cat ball during the day in the red pod. Why did you mention about playing chat for? Benedict. Benedict. Or Benedict. <laughs> Alright, so what I'm understanding is that the spirits, like one of the spirits, were saying that they shouldn't be dead and that the area that we were investigating at was a bad area to be in when I was feeling the energy of where it might be the most active which is the area that we're at right and the response from the ghost said avoid this area so that's so far the evidence that we got and like I said the cat ball we got red pot activity red pot activity we got um, definitely heard a few voices like when I asked the ghost can you use your energy to light up the red pot and the ghost replied just like this. Now, that was cool. I cannot wait to replay that back and add that text to where you all can make out what it's saying as well in the video. That'd be really cool. But it literally said no. Like this. Now. Oh, it was I'll so cool. You. Ooh, I'll affect you. Woo. And then it just said about avoiding this area. Why do you want to affect me for? You could talk to me. I will affect you. I hear your voice. They're an evil entity here. Feel. Yes, I do feel you. If there's an evil entity here, can you light up that cat ball? We lit up the red pod. Can you light up the cap off? There's an evil entity here. 
the one right there. The good spirits can let me know if there's an evil entity here that we should be aware of by lighting up that cap out, please. I know you're letting me know by the rent pod. Push. Chris, you got a push for one? Here you go to push. Try to push me over. I'm not afraid of you. What's with the blue? Not Don't sure. antagonize. Don't antagonize. Light up to blue again. You just let it out to blue. Do it again. Do it again. Now. Thank you. There's an evil spirit in here. I know. A hole. If you're evil, light up to blue. I lit it up to blue. Can you light up to green? If you're that strong. It's lined up to yellow. Feel something behind me. All right, y'all. So there thirteen. Is thirteen. Today, the dot tank. Today is July 13th, and the spirit talker just said 13. And there is an evil entity here at the cemetery. Um, and it just confirmed it when I said, can't. And it just confirmed it when I asked the evil entity, if you're evil, can it light up to blue? And it lit up to My blue. My death was brutal. And it, lit up, and it lit up to blue. And then we got a response about my death was brutal. You're coming back, aren't you? I know you're walking around. Can you tell us what you did that made yourself the evil spirit you are? May I touch you? If you want, just don't hurt me. And before you were talking, when I asked that question about what did you do to make you an evil spirit, I heard I killed people. Like, legitimately, I heard I killed people. That's what made the spirit evil. That spirit when that person was alive killed people. And it just had a response on a spirit talker, may I touch you? Why did you kill people? Talk to me. Why did you kill people? The devil is here. Make yourself known. Be very loud.
but can you tell me why did you kill people? They got her revenge. It went to yellow. It did? Mm-hmm. Did you kill people for revenge? Step away if you did. Ten. 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 You killed ten people? Out of revenge? If you killed 10 people, can you light, light up the red pot to yellow again? Thank you. Oh, and light it up to yellow. <sighs> All right, so a recap of walking. what's walking yes I hear you walking recap of what we captured here so there's an evil entity and there's a few good spirits here and that evil entity it was confirmed when we it was on response with the red pot so that was really cool however I think it's not best to be here this long you know what I'm saying but we did Got the evidence that we needed, got the answers that we needed. The voices were definitely strong. Um, and when I asked the evil spirit, like, why did you kill those 10 people? And the spirit said, well, it was out of revenge. Even if it was just revenge, there is no need to kill 10 people. You know what I'm saying? So I don't know why she decided to go up and do all that. So. Yeah, that's kind of disturbing in a way. And then the spirit talker had a response saying, may I touch you? And it said, push. And it said, devil's hair. Like, ugh. And it said, planchette. I'll affect you. I'll affect you, yeah. Like, um, this might be a good investigation to come here at night. However, um, might need to bring protection. That was her. That was her. So the good spirit thought that was a female. Secret. Ooh. So the good spirit that was a female was telling us to warn us about that evil entity. If so, that female spirit, could you light up the right pod for yes? Or the evil entity was the female. Ooh, I just got the energy right after I said that too. So the female killed 10 people. Is that correct, William Paul? Can you let us know? A lot of the red part of the female killed 10 people. Interference. It's an energy interference from not being able to use that rip pod because we're having a secret be put out. So they don't want to tell us. But with the answers that we've gotten, the evil spirit is a female. And that's what I heard while I was walking around a cemetery, right? I heard a female's voice. That could have been her. And that's why I was like coming into this area to do this investigation. But since we do not have protection at the moment, it's best not to do her the investigation at night till we come back with protection, like a cross or something, you know? I'm really here. I know you are. I know you're really here, I feel you. 
But yeah, when we come back at night, we're gonna be sure to break across for extra protection to make sure we don't get hurt. So we're gonna end this investigation. Let me know what y'all think about this evidence we captured here. This place is definitely active with voices, energy, bad juju, Little girl. and all sorts of among other things. And there is an evil entity here. She killed 10 people. It's a female entity that's evil. Definitely need to bring her across for our protection when we come here at night. And I also said about the devil is here. Not sure of how true that is, but I do know that there is a female spirit ship. Ship. ship female spirit here that's evil that killed 10 people out of revenge all right y'all make sure to smash the like button share the video out subscribe to the channel kpe paranormal love and peace